it's summertime. My name's Bob Hartman, and I'm here at a place called The Cross Guns, uh, a pub where I do a lot of my writing between Bradford-on-Avon and Bath in lovely Wiltshire. There you go. There's some sunshiny stuff out there. And um, the river's just down at the bottom of the hill here. The swans are swanning. The paddle boarders are paddling. The trains are training. You might hear one later. And the weir is weirring. Um, it's a lovely, lovely summer's day. And I'm here to talk to you about some lovely summer reading you can share with your children. I'm going to start with some books that are for very, very young children indeed, for babies, in fact, who are not going to be reading the books with you, but who would benefit from you reading the books to them and exposing them to some very simple things about God's Word right from the beginning. Words are good. Knowing that God loves them is good. And that's what these lovely baby books do. Yep, they're board books, illustrated by Ruth Pearson, gorgeous pictures, and they're based on certain passages of scripture. Very simple indeed, just a few words per page, I mean very few words per page, that celebrate the life of babies. So, we've got Wonderful Baby here, which is based on Psalm 8, and celebrates the fact that God speaks through the cries of infants and children. We've got Beautiful Baby here, which is based on Genesis chapter 1, which celebrates the fact that every child is made in God's image. We've got Brilliant Baby here, based on Psalm 131, which talks about us being like children, looking lovingly and trustingly into the eyes of our parents. And finally, we've got Precious Baby here, based on Jeremiah 1 verse 5, which celebrates the fact that God loves us and knows us even before we're born. I'd just like to recommend those to you as books that you can either read to your own children or get as christening gifts or gifts for your grandchildren or godchildren or whatever babies are um, are in your life. These are gorgeous books, beautifully produced. Uh, they're board books, so they're sturdy. And you can, as I say, share God's word with your kids from the very earliest age. The other books I want to tell you about are the rhyming parable books. Um, they are kind of accompaniments to the rhyming Bible that I did several years ago. There are four of them. I've got two of them to show you right here. This is the Precious Pearl, and it's all about the story of the Pearl of Great Price, but it expands on all the things that the man sold in order to um, acquire the money to buy the pearl. You can hear it. There's the train over there picking up people in Avoncliffe. Very nice. The illustrations are by the wonderful Mark Beach, who also did the rhyming Bible. Another book in the series is One Sheep Short, which is the story, uh, as you can imagine, of the um, lost sheep. We've also got the parable of the builders and the parable of the wedding feast, the fantastic feast. So those four books are for older children, ages three to five, and I think even a little bit older than that. As I say, the picks are absolutely brilliant. I mean, Mark is a fantastic illustrator. You're losing my face, but you're getting the picks. And I think your kids will absolutely love them and enjoy wandering through the parables with them. So, summertime, time for reading. Share these books with your kids. Let them read themselves if they're able and um, share God's word with them as you do it. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.